एवरी वन टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू अंडरस्टैंड मेजरमेंट ऑफ वोल्टेज ड्रॉप एट बी एल डी सी मोटर टर्मिनल फॉर दिस एक्सपेरिमेंट वी नीड द टूल्स एज ई रिक्शा वेहिकल और फोर व्हीलर बग्गी वेहिकल इन रनिंग कंडीशन और फोर बैटरीज फॉर ड्राइव आर्किटेक्चर बी एल डी सी मोटर एंड मोटर कंट्रोलर एंड थ्रॉटल एंड मल्टीमीटर एंड कनेक्टिंग वायर्स एंड द सर्क्यूट डायग्राम इज एज फॉलोज हियर वी हैव टेकन फोर बैटरीज here we have taken four batteries are connected in series and there are six connections they are two important to run the bldc motor this is power wire connection from batteries to the controller and ignition wire motor phase wire controller phase wire and hall sensor wire and throttle wire connection and after connecting we have to follow the procedure as the connections are as per the circuit diagram connect mcb in series with power wire for protection purpose here and then switch on the mcb and motor will run when accelerator applies measure the voltage across batteries that is the total voltage of battery pack and next measure the voltage of every phase of bldc motor and next Note on the values. Total voltage of battery pack we got as 50 volt approximately, and voltage across BLDC motor as 17 volt. That is also approximately, and voltage drop equal to voltage of battery pack minus voltage across BLDC motor. That is for particular phase, 50 volt minus 17 volt. We got the value of 33 volt. This is the voltage drop at BLDC motor is 33 volt, and for this we have to study the theory part as the voltage drop at the terminal of BLDC motor that is brushless DC motor in an e-rickshaw refers to the reduction in voltage that occurs when the motor is running that is called as voltage drop. This drop in voltage is primarily caused by the resistance of the motor windings. and the internal losses within the motor so the voltage drop at motor terminal is the difference between voltage of battery pack and voltage of particular phase at desired speed for this experiment we are taking four batteries total voltage is 48 voltage and bldc motor and junction box and controller and one throttle before going to connect first we have to take the positive and negative terminal of the voltage of these four batteries and connect mcb in series with the batteries for protection and take positive and negative terminals to the terminals of <coughs> controller battery positive terminal to the controller positive and battery negative terminal to the controller negative and next connect the terminals of motor these connection to the junction box these three wires should be respective to the controller wire that is nothing but yellow to yellow blue to blue and green to green and next connect the hall effect sensor this is hall effect sensor and this wire connection also match to the color both the sides green to green and uh, black to black and all the colors should match both the sides and this one is the ignition wire this one we have to short to the positive of the positive wire of the controller and next connect the throttle connection to the controller and after connecting we have to switch on the mcb and give the accelerator and the motor will rotate this one is anti clockwise direction if you want in forward direction we have to connect short the wire for this connection this one gives the forward and reverse connection and now we have to measure the voltage of the 
four batteries connect positive and negative terminal of the multimeter to the controller positive and negative and connect this probe to the 200 volt dc we are getting 58 volt of total voltage of battery now can measure the voltage of the motor this we are getting around 17 up to 17 to 20 voltage from this experiment we are going to calculate the before we have 58 voltage of battery and here we are getting 13 to 17 voltage this is the voltage of motor we have to check for all the three wire phases and we are getting same here 15 and next for the blue wire we are getting 15 and for yellow wire we have to getting 15 for this we have to connect positive to the phase wire and negative to the negative of the battery while calculating this voltage drop we have to subtract the value of total voltage battery and the value of motor voltage now we have to short this wire to the forward and reverse connection so we are getting in motor is running in forward direction